Good morning, math students. And I am going to show you a quick fact fluency activity you can do. And for this activity, you're going to need um, an old egg carton without any eggs in it, a Sharpie, and then two rocks or two seeds or two beans to put inside. Okay, you can also use your whiteboard to write down some of your equations you're going to generate. And you'll need a marker and something to white foot. And since I don't have an eraser at home, I'm going to use this old sock. Okay, so that said, you're going to open the egg carton. And in the first row, you're going to write numbers 2 to 9, like this, 2, 3, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then from here to where you stopped, you're going to start from zero. Zero, one, two, and three. And you can go ahead and write any one digit numbers you want. The important thing is to have two uh, rows of numbers. Okay, and then you're gonna take your, your rocks or your seeds. And I had plums for lunch today, so I'm gonna use the plum pits and or beans and put them in there. And then you're going to And then you're gonna open. And both of mine are on seven. So I have a doubles fact, seven plus seven. Equation five plus eight. And I'm going to do um, making tens, eight, nine, ten, and I have three left over. That makes 13. Okay, and I'll show you one more and then. Two plus five. So I'm going to count up like I learned how to do last week. Five, six, seven. Okay, and I am generating equations. Now if you want to challenge yourself, you can go ahead and do that. And you can add a, a third item. So a third plum pit. And you can do three added equations. And now I have three plus five plus six. So I have a three addend equation here and I'm going to write 3 plus 5 plus 6 okay. and I'm going to count up from the highest number 6, 7, 8, 9 and then I'm going to make a 10 with 1 plus 9 and then I'm going to have 4 left over and 14. Okay. And you can do that too. All you need is a sharpie an old egg carton and um, some rocks or seats or buttons or beans, two to three, to shake around. And this is your math fact fluency shaker. All right, have a good rest of your day.